Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go. We're in fall now. Big thank you to everyone that subscribed to the channel so far. We crossed 1,000 subscribers a couple weeks ago. I apologize I wasn't able to make a video at that moment, but I am super grateful for all of you, all your support, all your comments, all your likes, all your subscri subscribes, and uh, yeah, just uh, all of your thoughts and everything that you guys have uh, contributed to this channel and you know been on this journey with me. I think right now we're at 1,100 subscribers, so. We are still climbing. And uh, I'm just grateful for all of you that watch my videos. And uh, I appreciate the support. And let's keep this channel going. How's it going, everybody? It's Kim Dorian. Welcome back to the channel. Thanks for clicking on this video. I appreciate you. It's a beautiful fall day here. I'm gonna take the Vulcan 650 out for a ride. Catch some nice trails. See how that fall foliage looks. trick-or-treaters out check this house out we got tons of mannequins happy Halloween So this will probably be the last ride, if not one of the last rides that I do for the year. It's starting to get pretty cold here in New Jersey. So winter is here or very fastly approaching. So gotta take advantage of these slightly warmer days while we have them. And definitely wanna capture some nice fall foliage for you all. I'm definitely not putting my bike away yet for the winter in terms of winterizing it but I'm thinking I'll probably wait until maybe end of November early December and then actually winterize it just because uh, I know we sometimes get random warm days and I'll definitely take advantage of those to take the bike out I just bought this bike in I think April or March of this year so this is my first riding season with the bike so I am uh, a little sad that it's almost coming to an end for the year them trees beautiful trees actually not bad today it's about 62 degrees um, it's a nice cool temperature not too hot or too cold I do have a few layers on just in case but uh, I'm feeling good right now I'm not feeling cold at all I'd say probably like 50s low 50s is the lowest I'd go in terms of riding in the in this temperature because it gets too cold I do have a uh, 
thicker riding gloves but they're just not as comfortable kind of lose some dexterity in the fingers just because of how thick they are uh, but these uh, Sadichi gloves are great these are probably my favorite gloves I did get one question about all my riding gear so I guess uh, I'll do a riding gear video at some point all of my stuff is pretty beginner budget stuff it's not like super high-end Alpine stars or any racing gear or anything like that um, wow look at that look at these beautiful trees it's magical um, but yeah so yeah none of my gear is really high-end probably all together on my gear I spent I guess like a hundred dollars for boots 30 to 40 for gloves 100 and something for the jacket probably like I guess 90 for the helmet so yeah maybe like in total three or four hundred dollars for all my gear which is not too bad definitely do need to upgrade my helmet because this helmet sucks it's like a cheap helmet I got from Amazon which uh, isn't the smartest thing to do because obviously your head is the thing you want to protect the most but it's a uh, it's okay it's okay for now if you have any recommendations for a, a good helmet that's not gonna break the bank please let me know in the comments below We're looking to spend I guess up to $300 more if it if the, if the helmet is worth it and warrants that much money so right now I'm taking you guys to my favorite spot which I usually always go to on my rides just to see how these trees have changed Wow if you check out some of my previous moto vlogs from the summer all these trees were just green you know like very dark green but now you've got the beautiful fall colors, the yellow, the reds, the orange, the brown. It's very nice. Got a little traffic jam here. Hope this car doesn't stop here. Thank you. This is my spot. We are back at my spot. Beautiful view. And we got a beautiful bike here. All right, let's get back on the road. Looks like the sun came out a little bit, peeking through the clouds. Blessing us with the sun rays. the weather feels even better got that cool breeze and that sunshine got the smell
smell of wood burning in the air smell of the exhaust on the motorcycle vibration that engine roaring this is a beautiful life Beautiful trees. So you've got a horse farm here. The horsies. Oh, they got a lot more. They used to only have like one or two. So they got like five now, five or six. A little horse playground. So I'm going to be putting out a couple more riding videos, some moto vlogs before the year ends, weather permitting of course. Um, I'll probably do like a quick winterization video on how I winterize my bikes. Um, what else? What else? I did do a poll to see what you guys wanted to see more videos of and uh, I wasn't surprised to see that most of you wanted more motorcycle videos which is wonderful um, but since I'm in New Jersey winter is coming and I won't be able to ride as much probably from like December to end of February March ish so I'm gonna still put out videos um, during that time just not 100% sure what videos yet I was thinking of doing some videos on investing, the stock market, crypto, because that stuff is just, you know, on everyone's mind lately. And uh, it is good to plan for your future with investments. And uh, yeah, you don't want to miss the boat, you know, you don't want to miss the, the ride that we're all on with investing in stocks and crypto. Cryptocurrencies are just booming. Bitcoin above 60,000. People say it could be half a million one day, it could be worth a million per coin one day. So it's definitely worth getting some if you can now. I wonder when these pine trees will change. I guess they, oh, there's a few yellowish ones there, but I guess they change later than everyone else. All these other trees, some of these are just like beautiful reds and browns. And oh, this one's like a green, yellow, brown all in one. Look at that. I'm just glad I was able to get out today and ride. We've had tons of rain the last couple days and weeks and it's just been really cold. And obviously you can't ride after work. Wow, look at that. Beautiful yellow. Obviously you can't ride after work because uh, the sun goes down by like 6 now so by the time I get home it's already night time. I did try doing a night riding video um, and I actually recorded it but it was just too dark. I need to figure out my GoPro settings a little more to make it so you can actually see something. But there is some things you can do to tweak the settings just so it uh, has a little bit more visibility but uh, yeah I'm gonna tweak the settings a little bit give it another shot and see how it goes it is a totally different feeling riding at night is a little spookier just cuz uh, everything's dark you don't see as much and uh, especially in the rear view you know the your rear view mirrors if there's nothing behind you no cars or no lights it's just black you don't really see anything so um, yeah, it's very different. It is a, uh, it is enjoyable. It's just very different, and you yeah, obviously have to be a little bit more careful. And uh, you don't see as much in terms of, uh, 
you know foliage or just trees or trails or the road or really that much more I do have the stronger LED headlight that I installed aftermarket LED headlight so that definitely improves visibility on the road and just you know ahead of you um, it's definitely much better than the stock headlight so check out the video that I did on installing the headlight oh yeah here we go here we go we're in fall now I think the yellow, the yellow, the bright orange, and the red are probably the my favorite trees in terms of the colors. I mean, I guess that's everything, right? That's all the colors you see anyway. The leaf just hit me right in the face. Well, that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed the fall foliage on the Vulcan 650. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that like button. Help this channel to keep growing. I'll be putting out tons more content. Again, I appreciate you guys. And I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.